It's time for another grocery haul, but I have to get specific things in this haul. Hi, we are Luke and Heather Bell, and we have eight children, and we are just the Bells 10. So my grocery haul is specific. Pacific. No, specific. Specific. So I need to do a toiletry haul. I haven't done one since like August. Me and Izzy did a toiletry haul. And then my husband is asking for drinks. Um, he normally does the ahas and stuff, but he thinks he needs to start switching to water or some kind of drinks that don't have the carbonation in them, like maybe a flavored water or um, he says he wants stuff in cans because we can recycle cans. I mean, we can recycle plastic too, but it doesn't make sense to me to have like like my boys buy water bottles because they don't like the water instead of just buying like a water filter, but we have decent water. So he says he wants something that he can just sit down and drink, but without the carbonation and all the extra stuff. So I'm going to be on the lookout for that. Um, we do like these vinegar drinks. Um, they're expensive though. They're like three something a shot, but I mean, my husband works hard. So if I have to buy that for him to help him feel better, he's been having a lot of pain in his legs and stuff. So I'm kind of thinking that me and him need to get into shape. We gotta, I mean, I'm, I'm day three of eating well. Um, I need to get him down in the weight room with me. Somebody just pulled in. I don't know who that is. And now they're pulling out. Uh, I never know who shows up at my house. So I'm gonna head for the toiletry and to get my husband these drinks. Um, tomorrow is our big pumpkin carving contest. Um, so I have a couple things to get for that because I'm making a super cool cutery, Halloween cutery. It's gonna be amazing. So I have to get a couple things for that, but I basically don't need a lot because I have gotten like sausage and cheeses and things. But so I'm going to go meet Haley and we're going to do um, this haul to get ready for, well, not get ready for anything, I guess. I mean, a little bit for the Halloween, but for the most part, um, we're down to one big roll of toilet paper. You know, that, that Charmin thing I bought has three big ones. Well, we're down to one and that's pretty much it. And all the kids are on their way home and boys and you know how boys are so we're gonna head in and get the haul started let's get it started ha let's get it started yeah let's get it started ha let's get it started you know that song right <laughs> i have a couple stores i have to go to um i have not been to town since let's see oh i gotta do my friday finds um, I haven't been in town since, uh, looks like the FedEx truck is coming probably to my house. <laughs> it's like almost to my driveway. Hello FedEx. Okay. So I made it to Walmart. Um, uh, my daughter Haley's meeting me here. I'm going to go in and get the things I need for my toiletry haul. Toiletry. You know, my kids make fun of me because they say my O eyes like bull, all. How's it supposed to be? Boil? That doesn't even feel right with my mouth. Boy, y'all. Boy, y'all. See, my cheeks must be a little tight to say boy, y'all. Bowl. Boil. Bowl. Shrimp bowl. Bowl. Uh, toiletries. It just makes sense to me. Toiletries. I mean, yeah, I guess it does sound a little different, but I mean, everybody's going to be a little different, right? <laughs> bowl. Bowl. Hey, y'all. I'm fixing to. What's up, y'all? whatever i me am who me am and that's all me am that was supposed to be popeye but i sounded like a little bit like um um the pirate guy kind of i'm going to go in and get my toiletries oh i did it right there toiletries toiletries so if i get my mouth like this toiletries i can do it <laughs> but i'm not gonna walk around like this Hey, how are ya? How are ya? I'm a pirate. I, I could get away with it now because it's Halloween, but after Halloween to be like, um, she has issues. Yes. Yes, I do. My daughter in the honking rig for the farm. There she is. Master. Yeah, you got it. You got it. You're good. Look at that. Look at that. Because the windshield wipers broke. So David created this windshield wiper thing but it's so dangerous so that's why they came home and we went back in to finish they had to get home though hello she is you ready to help me with my friday finds oh yeah 
Heck yeah. Okay, I got my sweet daughter. She's gonna help me find my Friday finds. But she's probably not gonna do them with me, are you? Yeah. Maybe, whatever. First stop, toilet paper. Cause I only have a couple rolls of toilet paper. So we're almost out of toilet paper. We have one of those rolls left. So we're gonna get some toilet paper. Here we go. I'm gonna stock up on toilet paper. Oof. Hold on. I'm gonna get two of them. Okay. Sorry, everybody's like, holy crap, she's horrible. All right, one more. I don't like getting odd numbers, but I will. All right, there we go. All right, my favorite in the whole world. So I need to get two more of these. There we go. And okay, two of these, one for the barn and one for the house. All right, there's one. And we don't want Febreze. I don't like any kind of fabric. All right, holy cow, my fingers gotta be super strong with this. All right, there we go. So I got the barn covered and the house, toilet paper and my okay, dish Okay, these are amazing. They're 388, but this is 24 by 38 and that's 30 by 40. 80 square feet. What is this though? How many square feet is this? That's a great idea, but it's gonna be cheaper. So I need two parchment papers. We'll get the hundreds. All right, these are set. All right, so my kitties got into my, my office and yeah, now we gotta clean it up. Ah. <sighs> animals love them gotta love them gotta love them so i can't find my normal ones so we're oh there they are right there it's only a two pack for 237 that's a three pack for 388 is that about the same a dollar ten yeah i'm gonna stick with what works so i need to stock up on these love them all right so i'm gonna pick up one of these because with a lot of boys the toilet has really been stinking and I don't really like it. So I'm gonna grab one of these. We're gonna try them in the toilet and see what happens to disinfect. And I like to use my magic erasers, but I'm having some lime issues. So I'm not really sure what to get with it. Oh, I don't like putting a lot of chemicals in my house, but sometimes you gotta scrub stuff. So I think I'm just gonna stick with what I know. And these are what I, oh, I don't want the flavored stuff. I don't want any smell. What's with all the smells? Here, this one has no smells. We're going to do lights I grab some paper towels. I don't usually get paper towels, but it's that or napkins. And that ain't going to fit, is it? All right, I need to get one of these for our washing machine. Cleaning that. And then my kids really like these for school. Okay, so I picked up some spray and wash. I don't need detergent because I love my Earth Breeze sheets. They're so great, biodegradable. They come in cardboard, amazing. All right, so I got all my toiletries for cleaning. Lint brushes, my scrubbies. Got to clean that washing machine. Going to see if this helps the smell of the toilet. My dish soap, tied on the go for the kids to school. My cat got in my office. Garbage bags, paper towel. We do do plate, some paper plates. I've been really trying hard. Parchment paper. I've been really trying hard to not use as many paper plates because I have a lot of people that keep saying they wish I would stop using so many paper plates. So I've been using the glass and washing them, but it's nice to have the paper plates if we're in a hurry or kids are coming and going. Um, so. I haven't been buying them as much as I used to because people are always messaging me, please stop using the paper plates. But we do have a wood stove, so we burn all this paper in our wood stove, so we do recycle all of our cardboard and paper. So my daughter got me, well, she didn't get it because I paid for it, but she actually walked and got it. Look what her mommy got her. Look what her mommy got her. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna head to the shampoos and conditioners and soap and toothpaste and stuff to stock up on that. And then I have to find drinks for so my Haley husband. Haley uses this shampoo. She says there's only 10 ingredients in it. Oh, so it tells you exactly what it is. Mm -hmm. What kind do you actually get? I get the coconut one, coconut and vanilla. Is there ones for different kinds of hair type? Like, is there one for curly? Is there one for? There's volumizing, moisturizing, and strengthening. Oh, I need volumizing. Is that what you get? No, I get moisturizing. Does, is, do you think, well, Izzy's got specific hair. Okay, I'll get this. All right, so my husband really likes these. We're gonna try the tea tree, the citrus, and the almond. 
All right, here's my husband's lotion that he has been using since we got married, before we got married, like 25 years he's been using this lotion. Wow. Yeah, I know, right? A long time. I'm gonna get two so I don't have to keep coming to the store for them. All right, these uh, toilet, these toiletry, sh uh, toiletry shopping hauls are nice every two months. All right, so now they have their snowdrop, orange clove, and we'll try pine and see. These are the fall scents. Okay, I'm gonna get getting two of these all over body wash. Every man jack. Hey, I need to get you know some allergy medicine because my eyes have been destroyed. And I can't find my mirror. Somebody took my mirror. Did you take my mirror home with you? No, I'm gonna give it to Izzy. It's on the desk. I'm gonna give it to Izzy. I haven't been able to find it for like weeks. I Oh, sucker. I didn't give it to her. I didn't give it to her. So we have a ton of toothpaste still. I have that smile right there. That kit. I bought that kit. Oh, yeah? Yep. I do need some whitening toothpaste so when I'm not using that whitening, it stays white. What do you use for whitening toothpaste? Do you use a whitening toothpaste? Um, There's a 3D white over there. Crest 3D white. Colgate white. What do you use? I I don't think it's, okay. no, it's the Oh, the Crest Strips. I think these Crest Strips really do work. I'm going to get one. Ooh, that didn't sound good. All right. Okay, so I picked up some allergy medicine because my eye is going crazy. Look at this cute little gnome guy from my tree. And then Haley got her, her ornament for our women's exchange. I got mine. Mine's way cuter. And then I picked up my husband's soap. I'm going to try the shampoo that Haley said. I got my mascara. We got some funky eyeliners and stuff for Halloween. And then I think the girls can wear these for football. Husband's soap. I got some more hand soap. My three-in-one soap lotion. I'm going to try these men's razors. Got Gideon and the boys some new stuff. Some 3D whites. Peroxide and alcohol. And then a couple candles for the fall. And then I got these cute little nativity scenes. One for Haley and one for Izzy. And I forgot to show you guys, I picked up pink lights for Izzy and green for my fall tree. Those are, they see the fingers. They totally see them. Sheesh. Okay, I need more of these containers. Oh good, they got the big ones back. I'm organizing my life. So I need two more of these. One and two. Look at the cutest yes. thing we found. It's a, it's a toaster for one slice and then a mini noodle maker. Isn't that cute? So we're gonna get one for Noah. What color should I get him? Black, red, or blue? Um, for like a, a fun gift. What do you I think? The black maybe? Or the blue? Yeah. Black? <laughs> All right, a little cute little. Cute okay, so I got Noah. candy for the kids' bags, two Christmas presents, bags. They each get a pair of socks, and I'm gonna go get them a special drink to put in the bags. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I spent $727. And I will tell you a couple of things that were crazy and look at. So I forgot to take the pumpkins out of the car and I don't know how I'm gonna get my groceries in my car now. I'm gonna have to put down those seats, Haley. You have to put it in the seats. I'll put it in the seats. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put all these groceries in the seat. They will. Let's shut that down. And uh, I'm gonna put everything in the seats. My car is packed. I just kept the pumpkins in there because it kept them cold and nice. Um, I end up getting three things of toilet paper. $90 for three things of toilet paper. Granted, they were big. And I had to get Claritin because my eyes are dying. I got children's Claritin. That cost me $50. So I'm already up to $140. That is not from me. That's probably from kids. What is that from? I don't know. And so then I end up picking up paper towel for the barn and garbage bags for the barn. That cost me, uh, the garbage bags were 50 bucks and the um, paper towels were $20. So that's another $60. So I spent 60 plus 50 is 111 plus 90. I spent $200 alone on toilet paper on um, paper towels, on garbage bags. Toiletries are crazy. This is why I don't come but once every two months. I haven't been here since August, I believe. If you guys go back and look at our videos, I'm pretty sure it was August that we were doing a, a toiletry haul. 
Plus I got some shampoos and stuff that were like 20 bucks a piece. My husband likes the castle shampoos. They're like an all over body. Those things are like 20 bucks a shot. So that's two, four, six. That's a hundred dollars. So $300 toilet paper, garbage bags, paper towels, um, Claritin and big, huge things of soap, but it's going to last us a while. So you're not going to, Oh, and my coffee. Yeah. I'll keep my coffee. So I spent $300 on like four different items. That is craziness. Absolutely craziness. I'm glad that our toiletries, like I said, is only like once every couple months because, and I did get a lot of stuff. So I don't think I'm going to be doing a toiletry haul for a while. And my house is like full of food. So we're not going to be doing a, a food haul either. So, um, but I do need that Claritin. It was completely worth the 50 bucks. Well, I came out, I went in and it was hot. I come out or went in and when it was cold, I come out and it was hot. So there's my toiletry haul and um, I'm rushing home, hoping to catch my kids before they go to the football game to help me unload these groceries. And well, not groceries. Do you call them groceries? I don't know. And all the stupid pumpkins I forgot to take out. And I have to tell you, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be doing these hauls in the grocery store. It's kind of embarrassing. Like you want to go down an aisle that nobody's down so people don't see you. And when you're videoing stuff, you look kind of stupid. So I, sorry, my kids are calling me. So <laughs> I like doing them. I like showing you guys what we're doing, but I'm going to start going either like midnight or first thing in the morning when nobody's around because it is a little embarrassing. I'm just like, oh, look at me. I'm grocery shopping and I'm like actually videoing myself grocery shopping. Everybody can watch me go grocery shopping. Look at that girl. She talks to herself. Even my kids are like, dude, like you're talking to yourself. And I'm like, oh, so we'll see. I'm going to have to figure out something. Like I said, late at night, or early in the morning, because I, just, I don't know. I just... I don't know. <sighs> All right. Well, I'm going to head home now, get some help unloading 120 rolls of toilet paper. <laughs> Crazy.